Hello guys, welcome back to a, another Silica video. It's been a few days, I know. I, I've, I've been AWOL for a few days, um, celebrating my wife's 30th birthday and such. And I've just been overly busy since Sunday. So, we're going to get in a video out today. We're also going live tonight with some Alien Dark Descent. If you want to join in on that, that is half past 7pm uh, UK time. Um, and yeah, if you're going to enjoy the video, please leave a like, subscribe, hit that bell notification button, you know, the good thing, leave some comments down below. Any other challenges you want me to do as well, uh, we are doing the Scout Only Challenge. <laughs> um, the reason why I'm a bit laughing about that is because I know how, um, how against the clock you are, I suppose, with Scouts. Um, 100 HP, the weapon's not very powerful. Um, your, your, your base scouting unit to start with as the humans, apart from the uh, quads. Uh, we'll see how it goes. Now, we're not going to go up against the aliens this time around. We're just going to go up against the humans and see how we fare. Um, right. Well, without further ado, guys, we're going to get straight into it. We are going to be going on to Rift Basin as per usual. And we are going to be doing human v. human scouts only. So... Just a few thoughts getting into this video. So, scouts, you don't actually have to build any tech whatsoever. So, I can literally just go straight into barracks and refineries. I don't have to worry about any other buildings. So, that could be it to my advantage. Um, we'll see how we go. We're going to go with salt this time around. I know you guys out there. Oh, yeah. Lycan's always been Centauri. You know, dirty soul. <laughs> I do apologize. But today, I'm just feeling a bit soul, you know? Uh, this is not correct. <laughs> I need to be the commander. Oh, no. What have I done? Right. So, commander. There we go. Okay. So, um, first of all, uh, stay still, buggies. Uh, 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 we got to do some Order 66. Come here. Come here. Order 66. It's my fault. I went as uh, infantry. Right. First of all, though, we'll get the refinery built because uh, we're going to need that before we build the barracks. And we'll get another one here. And we'll get a third one just there. Right. Anyway. We're going to do some um, glorious Order 66. Now, we're going to take control of the scout. Now, i got to find the rifleman. Hello, rifleman. Uh, you guys are scouts. You're good. You've got a small head. You're fine. You're fine, too. You're not fine. And you're definitely not fine. Right. So, now we've got to take down these quads. Now, let's see how much damage they take. Okay, it's not too bad. We'll, we'll, we'll kill off the pods, it's fine. Um, I'm sure I'm missing a rifleman somewhere. I'm sure of it. Oh, we'll find him in a minute. It's absolutely fine. Right. We're gonna, you know... Kill the quad. Right, so that's one quad. I would just activate cheats and just, like, delete them, but I feel like that, you know... You guys enjoy a bit of Order 66. There we go. Right. Are we good? Yep, we've just got six scouts remaining. There we go. Right. So we've got our army. We're currently uh, mid-left. So actually, we're, we're right next to a lot of Bolterium. Ideal. I do enjoy a bit of Bolterium. Now, we're going to have to go and find a Centauri. We're going to send all our scouts out of Centauri. Just because I know for a fact we're going to start building barracks pretty much straight away. And we're going to be able to pump out those scouts relatively quickly. So I'm not too worried about losing scouts. As soon as the first uh, refinery goes up, I'll be able to build the barracks straight away. So, uh, we're going to get the barracks, I'd like to say, here. You know what, we are. We're going to get the first barracks up straight away. And uh, we are actually going to do some human harvesting. We're going to do some human harvesting. We're going to do some work. Harvesting Simulator 2023. Here we go. Because we're going to need that money relatively quickly. Because we're going to have to start pumping out a lot of scouts from a lot of barracks. So we're going to start building these. And we're also going to get some more refineries as well. Um, these refineries, just to get more eco on the go. But yeah, guys. We are currently coming up to... Uh, two months in? To Silica's uh, life, you know, life at the moment. What do you guys think of the game so far? Are you enjoying it? Are you still playing it? Are you... Tuning in just for the challenge, or you know, let me know in the chat. We've got aircraft just around the corner, so uh, you know that is coming relatively soon. Um, also, the queue, uh, the, the quality of life fixes as well. Um, commander fixes, you know, FPS fixes. 
you know, all that sort of stuff. So what, what, what do you think, guys? You know, let me know in the chat below. Let me know in the comments. Um, what do you think about uh, the upcoming stuff that is coming out for the game? You also got the um, after the air units have been added and balanced and such. And then we've got to, uh, you know, have a look at those uh, glorious super weapons and the other stuff that Dram has uh, gloriously mentioned to us in our streams. You know, the, the shields, the uh, the ICBMs. You know, the, the big old alien titan screamy boy that's going to, you know, be as tall as a um, ultra heavy factory. So, interesting indeed. Right, okay, so we're delivering some glorious money. These two are going to be fighting naturally. Scouts are still struggling to get around um, some cover. Okay, well, we're just going to pump barracks out for the moment. Barracks, 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 and more barracks. Anywhere else? Oh, here comes the enemy light quad. So we've found Centauri's light quad. Oh, God. I don't think there's much I can do against it, really. I mean, I have to have a, ma a mass of uh, scouts to be able to deal with that. Uh, both of them are here, by the way, so... While we're building the barracks, we're gonna start pumping some scouts out because we're gonna need some, you know, some sort of, some sort of uh, defending force and such. Oh no! This is gonna end so badly. I already know this for a fact. I'm not building any headquarters for defensive purposes, by the way. So I'm only sticking with the one headquarters, just the solo headquarters today. Um. Right, you've got Balterium. You are currently playing about. Let's get you sorted. Also, guys, uh, Sunday the... I like to say the second. Let me just double check. Sunday the yep Sunday the second of July at half past seven UK time I'll be going live with um, Silica Sundays so if you want to play some Silica with the community jump on in it's free to anyone it's a thirty six player server um, I will try not to do Alien this time because last last Sunday I just gone it was pain absolute pure pain um, I was uh, in a human v Alien with the the two most based commanders when it comes to you know making um buildings and and getting up to speed relatively quickly i was at five frames per second within the first 10 minutes so um yeah that's that's i might avoid the aliens uh for this week but we'll see we'll see might do a bit of badlands badlands is really good for frame rate so might do that we might do that so we're building another three refineries i think that'll be my maximum refinery count that i'll be going for today uh, unless I need to branch out more and go for some more expansion. Um, the issue is that I know scouts are super weak. And they're not very accurate at range. So we might have issues here. We're going to have to just build a a, a lot. And, a, and I mean a lot of scouts. And just push the frontier with them. I mean they only cost 50 to produce. So we're, we're going to be able to like queue them up really quickly. And get them out onto the field. So we'll see how it goes. I mean they're constantly just dealing with these quads at the moment. They're struggling so badly. So badly. Like, I might have to just take control of one of my scouts here. Yep, ended up losing one of my scouts there. The HQ will open fire eventually as well, so... Okay, so the other refinery is about to come live, which means we're going to start getting more Balterium onto uh, the harvesters and into my bank, into my belly. Right, I have not located uh, where they are, so we're going to quick run these five over towards where I think Centauri resides. Okay, well, these quads are quite injured up anyway. That harvest is going to be starting to open fire. He's, uh, deciding what to do, Mr. Harvest. What are you doing? You're going to the northern patch? How about you go to the southern patch that we haven't seen yet? I definitely know there's one there. 
Tell you what, let's give him a bit of assistance, shall we? Oh, what is this? A buggy, you say? Oh, don't flip yourself, Mr. Buggy. Honestly, get grinded. <laughs> the Battle Harvester, yes. Yes. Easy kill. Too easy. Sorry, it had to be done. I know it's a, I know it's a scout-only challenge, and you guys are going to be like, oh, no, but use the Harvester. It's a fail. Oh, come on, man. It's a, it's, a, it's a Harvester. It's a Battle Harvester. First opportunity, you see a Harvester ready for combat. You take that opportunity. Yes. Annihilate. In your own time. Right. Okay, how are we looking? I don't know why you're struggling, but just relax, okay? I know you've gotten some glorious combat and you're excited. Just just relax. Go here. There's Bolt Aaron right there. Oh, look, another quad. I must have ordered this harvester to do something you should not be doing. Right, let's send him over to uh, deposit some funds. Let's start uh, creating our scout army. Let's see how we do. Okay, so I've located where Centauri are. They're currently uh, the top right area. We've got 10 scouts are moving across the field at the moment. They are sending a lot of infantry after me as well. It's almost like they know, you know. It's like they know. This poor scout had no chance. Oh my god. Right, slowly clean them up. And then we got to somehow get... Oh, God. We're going to leave the quads. The quads could get dealt by the mass. We're going to go for the infantrymen. They're too busy firing at someone else, so... Um, we should be good to get a few kills here. And just, you know, get rid of the attacking force in general. Okay, we've done relatively well there. Relatively well. Oh, hello. Well, that's prime time to kill some uh, some buggies. Go, my scouts! Annihilate! The on firepower. Oh, okay. So I'm pretty, uh, pretty uh, okay now with how scouts are performing. Um, you just need a mass of them, and then uh, it's 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 a good it's a good day, you know. Oh yeah, it wouldn't it wouldn't be harvester if the harvester wouldn't be uh you know fighting each other over a patch of bolterium, you know. It wouldn't be a good day for harvesters if that wasn't the case. Right, he's going over there. I'll tell you what. Right. You over there. You up there. You stay there. How are you doing? Oh, I didn't actually tell you to go harvest. I just told you to go over there. Okay. Well, I'm going to build another refinery. And I'm going to build a, another refinery. Wait, no, I'm not. Well, no, I can. I can build one here, I suppose. And I can also build one to the north. I've got a lot of money left. Um, again... Scouts don't cost that much, so the more you know, the more refineries I have, the better chance I will be getting a lot of funds as well. So uh, we're going to continue doing that. Uh, oh god, we've got a lot of scouty boys ready. 
I kind of want to build more barracks. I'm, uh, yeah, I'm going to build some more barracks. We're going to build some more barracks. You know what? Yeah, why not? That'll do now. I build one. We're going to build more barracks. I build one. Okay, we'll build more. We'll build... I want, I want to build one here, but... Tell you what, why not? There you go. Right, that'll be enough barracks for now, because scouts are cheap. They get, you know, they get made quickly. They, you know, they get... I don't know. How are scouts made? <laughs> they get trained quickly. There we go. Don't answer that question, guys. I don't want to know how uh, scouts are made. Oh, baby. We have got scouts galore exiting the field. We've got incoming. We've got quads. I just can't wait to see, you know, a tank just annihilate a whole army of my guys. I got dropped quickly. Real quickly. Let's give some assistance to this harvester quickly. Unfortunately, I did give him a bit of a, uh, a sticky situation to navigate, so I don't blame him for it. But I will assist him when I, where I can. I mean, he got, he got literally to the refinery, so, you know, good on the harvester. Oh, God. There we go. He should be alright getting back in now. Right. How are we looking? I mean, we're still technically in a massive ons onslaught at the moment. Uh, but it's just been quads and infantry so far from the enemy. So we're okay at the moment. Um, I need to start constructing again because... Yeah. These barracks are not producing anymore because they produce so damn quickly. However, I'm going to have a lot of harvesters coming in with Bolterium. So, oh yeah, we're going to have a lot of bolt here on the field. Why haven't you gone in yet? There we go. Okie dokie, so... Yes, scouts, just all scouts. They only take 10 seconds to build, by the way, so that's why, you know, I'm not building that many barracks because they, they, they get produced so, so quickly. So it could be a viable tactic, really, like early game. If, if you just got tons of money and you just you want to challenge yourself, you know, just produce a massive a scale amount of scouts. I just send them at the enemy. And also, if you want to commit, you know, early game suicide, then, yeah, carry on. Because uh, they'll just end up sending tanks eventually, and then you, you, you just, you're dead anyway. Especially if you're going up against someone like Lucker or, uh, or Matter. You know, being able to produce those units really, really quickly. Um. <laughs> uh. By the time I got my barracks up, they would have their first heavy factory, so... That's, that's how it works, basically. That's how it works. Okay. Heavy quad. Annihilated. We're going to build up like a mega force of... Uh, of scouts. Like a beyond mega force of scouts. This is kind of like our starting army for defensive purposes. Oh no, there's a heavy. Yes, yes, wait, wait. Wait in, wait in ambush. He will not know what hit him. Oh my god, he annihilated like this whole section here. Oh no. Oh god, right, okay. We're going to see the full extent of what using a scout is like. We've got a, uh, a force of about 40 scouts, I do believe. 
No, less than that. Against one a light armored car. That's not too bad, actually. I was expecting it to be a lot worse, but I think we had cover to our advantage. I think if we were just in plain open, open ground, it would have been another story. Okay, we're almost ready to push the frontier. That harvester has been a right champion. Look at the path he took. Oh my god, the pathing from that harvester is absolutely nuts. Oh, we've got more money than... I don't know what to do with this money, you know? I might build some more barracks. Just just build more barracks. You know, you got too much money? Build barracks. Create units. I literally cannot expend the money I'm bringing in. I've got too much of it, and these are too cheap. So, they just get produced way quick. Uh, How much are they? 50 each. 100, 100 HP. Build time of 10 seconds. It, it could it could possibly be a... Uh... I don't know if they should be nerfed. I don't know if they should have any, like maybe an increased build time. Same with the riflemen. I think the riflemen are only 20 seconds. Yeah, they are. They're only 20 seconds. What do you guys think? Do you think uh, infantry units in general need to have a increase their time? I just feel like 10 seconds for scout and 20 seconds for rifleman could be just a bit too too quick. And obviously, if if that was the if that was the case, it might have to be changed for the, the crab as well. I don't know. I don't know. Like, I don't want to. I don't want to get into balancing, you know, too too much because um, there is a lot of things you got you got to ask as well when you start balancing units. You've then got like counterbalance the opposite factions and and, and such. So it can become a bit of a mess relatively quickly. Uh, but I do feel like scouts are produced real, real quick. Like I'm I'm producing them so damn fast, and I still have so much money. And to be honest, if I get them inside of the enemy HQ, it's GG's. Because the HQ won't be able to open fire and defend itself. I'll just be able to annihilate them straight away. So. I keep forgetting. I need to issue a uh, move fast uh, command to these guys. Oh, well, that army got annihilated. But there is, what, one heavy armored car left? Versus, I mean, a, a big onslaught of human... And apparently harvesters now as well. Oh my god, the harvesters, man. We'll see how we go. We're we're building force. We're not gonna just send in a little a little you know tiny scout force. We're gonna go for a full full force. How is this? Uh, what's this scout doing? He's in a rock. How are you in a rock? Like what? Okay, so the six... Oh my god! I, I was going to say I had 65 scouts there. But that one heavy just annihilated half of that force. Like, just instantly, you know? You just have to quick run. You know, you just have to quick move your guys. Oh, they're just dead. They're just dead outright. They can firebolt sprinting, so... Uh, god, these vehicles, no... I'm not. I'm not happy with what I'm seeing here. We're, we're we're approaching that critical level where we'll start seeing hover tanks, and that's where things start to get real tricky. What happened to my guys here, by the way? Oh, there's fifty. There's still fifty of them. Okay, so 
This is going to be like our main force here built to the south. It's the one that's less contested, so I'm pretty happy with uh, moving them in as like a, a, a force of like 100 or such, or maybe more, and seeing how well they fare. And then we'll kind of get a gauge on how um, how easy this is going to be. Because at the minute, we're just bare we're not even moving past this section here we're before tanks are sent after us, so we're we're having a few issues there. But again, we've got just so much money. So much money, and the barracks are building so quickly. Okay, so the army of scouts are mobilizing. We're going to quick move them up to 52. Let the other lot start to, uh, you know, mold in to position. Ah, yes. Typical harvest of playtime. You love to see it. Go north. Oh my god. <laughs> oh no. Oh, the heavies are the worst thing for these scouts. The heavies are nasty. They just annihilate, like, just loads of them. I dread to, dread to know what a rocket launcher can do to these guys. Just so busted. Right, where's my headquarters? There it is. We are going to produce some more barracks. Because I've, I still feel like... Yeah, I've got a lot of barracks built, but they're, they're producing them so quickly that I'm, I'm constantly like microing the production of uh, scouts. And I kind of want to just like, you know, build a massive ton of them and just leave them to their, you know, to their thing. So, I'm going to build some more barracks just for that. But just as quick as that, like, all of them are built and these barracks are doing nothing. You're mining. How are we looking? How's this army looking now? Right, we're almost there. We're almost there. We're almost ready. This army's pushing up. I mean, they're too busy having a fight. Oh, speaking of rocket launcher, here we go. Ah, oh, here we go. We're having a... I mean, the rock and all just getting right in, like, into the middle of what's happening. So, this one should get dropped quite quickly. Okay, so we've got 200 strong here. Let's march to the headquarters. Let's quick move to the headquarters, even. If we can annihilate the headquarters and stop some manufacturing new buildings, and then from there we can spread out and start dealing with their buildings. They've got an ultra-heavy vehicle factory. No siege tank yet. So I am lucky. Oh, they've got their first hover tank. Great. Okay. Let's see how we fare against old hover boy. We might just lay an ambush around this corner, you know, be a, be a sneaky boy. We'll see. I cannot wait for hotkeys to come out, and I cannot wait for rally points to come out. And I know for a fact that is going to be real soon, guys. So definitely keep an eye out. Uh, yeah, because we're starting to see the command improvements come forth now. So that only means there's going to be more command improvements. So I could only assume that, like, uh, hopefully within a week or so, maybe more, we will see hotkeys, rally points. My frame rates are tanking. Um, I have got a, a massive amount of scouts moving all at once, so. Well, 200 moving in on their HQ at the moment. So. Oh god, they're struggling to build. There we go. Oh my god. 
The refinery's dead. It, it's just, it's just dead. There's just no, no hope. It's dead. We've come at like the right section of the HQ as well. We've come to the point where the HQ can't really open fire. Whenever you approach HQ, always approach it from the rear. I mean, the tech is dead. The headquarters is dead. This marksman is not going to be able to do anything. Brrr. Oh my god. Yep, tech's gone. Headquarters half, uh, just over half health. About to go to half now. The marksman just got shredded. Uh, headquarters is gone. I think this is GG's. Just, just, yeah. Just GG's. Unless it's a heavy. But, uh, yeah. The headquarters is gone. There's no longer building. That scout just got lasered. Look at that. Burr. Just pure burr. Oh my god. That barracks is getting shredded. Just to put that into perspective as well, your traditional RTS game uh, unit cap will most likely be 200 at, at the max, really. Unless, you know, you're looking at like, Annihilation games and stuff like that, right? I've got that unit cap in a single force here. That's about to get annihilated by one hit single heavy. Never mind. He got beamed. How many did I lose? I lost. I only lost about seven. So, right. Well, two hundred scouts versus a whole enemy uh, a, a AI human base. Um, scouts win. The tanks have moved in though, and they are starting to hold me back here. But I have got like another what fifty, sixty stacks of ten moving up. I've got another big stack of humans coming up here as well. Some uh, scouty boys. Um, speaking of scouty boys, they're sending scouts after me. Uh, what are you going to do with your single scout, my friend? Oh my god. <laughs> like a Gatling gun going off. It is like a Gatling gun. I'm just going to annihilate the building because then I win, basically. This uh, this hover, hover tank army here sat on my barracks at the moment. Um... They might kill the barracks, but that's as far as they get, really. You know? Don't worry about the harvester, guys. Just go for the uh, heavy, heavy factory. Is it producing? No. No, and have they got any funds? I mean, there's a harvester returning. They got zero funds in the tank, so it is it is a, uh, a done deal for Centauri. How many minutes are we in? Half an hour. Half an hour game. Well, I wasn't expecting that for Scouts v. Human. Perhaps I should have brought the aliens in. Perhaps for the next video, I will do the humans and aliens. Because then I've got to deal with melee as well. So that could be interesting. But yeah, there we go. That is all production buildings dead for Centauri. They send their tanks in. Ooh, actually, they did annihilate quite a lot of my guys. Well, well played to them. Well played. But it's a little too late. You're, you're too late on building building those uh, those vehicles to take me on. You have signed your own deal. As soon as I annihilate this uh, refinery, it is GG's. I mean, the harvester is open to fire. My guys are open to fire too. The big burr is coming in. Big old burr of units. My god, the, the frame rate is well. A 10 frame per second gamer. But, I mean, can you, can you, mind you, ballistics as well. There are proper, like, f physics and ballistics in this game. So, the, we're, we're capped out as well uh, uh, for money. So, it is, like, calculating each and individual bullet and where, where it's going. So, there's a lot of things going on behind the scenes for this game. Uh, where are you going, guys? This is why I have to click multiple times, because you can see the pathing changes. Like, they were going to go down here, then come up here. It just didn't make sense to me. I wanted them to do this. So, they have a line of sight on this refinery. They're able to delete it from existence, and delete. It looks like uh, Sol 
sorry, not Soul Centauri, has lost all their vehicles that they had, the hover tanks and everything. And uh, we're into the final stages of this game. Looks like they sent down a light armored car versus one scout. This scout is able to win the fight against him. <laughs> there we go. So, guys, hopefully you enjoyed uh, this challenge. It was easier than I initially thought. Um, I did think I was going to run into uh, issues with uh, tanks and such. Actually, I didn't kill their tanks. The tanks actually returned to base, but it was a little too late. I already, you know, finished off the whole uh, the whole base with 200 plus scouts. I mean, I had another probably like 100 to 200 scouts at base, so it was one of those. So, guys, without further ado, I'll see you in the next one. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that bell notification button if you want to see some more Silica gameplay and news on Silica coming very soon. Peace.